Welcome to Perusal. In this video, you'll learn how to create a standalone course. To create a standalone course, register for an account at perusal.com. The onboarding process will walk you through the course creation. When you enter your Perusal account, there are four ways to create a course or study group. You can create a course as an instructor, copy a course from an existing course, enroll in a course that already exists, or create a study group. To create a course, click on the button. From there, you'll be given the option to integrate it with your LMS or to have it available as a standalone course. For a standalone course, you'll be prompted to fill out all the information. Course name, institution, course start and end dates, enrollment estimate, target group size, and your materials. You will also be given the option to choose your grading analytics. There are four options available to you from automatic grading and engagement analytics to disabling all analytics. You can manually change these settings later as well as specify your grading. In the library tab, you can choose all types of content for your course. A book from the Perusal catalog where we have over 800,000 titles, a web page, your own documents which include PDFs, Word documents, PowerPoints, and EPUBs. You can also upload video or podcasts. When uploading material from your device, you also have the option to clear the digital rights from the Copyright Clearance Center. Other library options include materials copied over from another perusal course, quizzes, iClicker, and a student folder. You can also add folders to organize content in your library. Once you have your materials uploaded, you can begin to create your assignments. Click on the Assignment tab and add assignment. Click on the material from the library you would like to assign. You can assign the full content or select parts of it. Add your submission deadlines, assignment names, instructions, and other information in the Options tab. You can customize your scoring settings for an individual assignment in the Scoring tab, or keep it the same as your overall settings for the course. If you are using a standalone perusal course, you can share the course with your students by copying the student code in Access. You can also share your course with other instructors by inviting them to the course. They will have full access to the gradebook and assignment settings. Teaching assistants can be added to the course with their emails. Teaching assistants will not have access to grades or assignment settings. Grouping is a great way to have insightful discussions in smaller groups. Perusal can automatically assign students to groups, or you can specify the groups manually. The Scoring tab offers you various options to specify your grading criteria. You can decide when to release scores to students, what scores students can earn, and customize the weight of specific grading. We have created a few presets for you to try. Holistic, annotation content only, focus on reading and watching, focus on social engagement, or focus on quizzes. You can change the percentage of each of the seven metrics for yourself and select the options dropdown to customize more. Note, the horizontal line for full credit tells you which metric will give your students full credit. You can also see student scores in the gradebook located on the left-hand side of your dashboard. If you click on the student score within the gradebook, you will be given a full breakdown of how your student earned that score. You can also provide feedback to your student here. Additional setup tools include, see the course in student view, check your notifications, your notes. These are private to the user and cumulative for the entire course. Add deadlines to your calendar. And under chats, you can make announcements to the class, have general discussions, or one-on-one -on -one chats with specific students. Hashtags are a great way to connect thoughts and ideas. Any student or instructor can create one. Thank you for watching. If you have any more questions or need any more help, contact support at perusal.com.